I was surprised to see this because I couldn't imagine that the filter elements themselves were actually introducing a disinfection byproduct into the water. I had a chat with the chemists at the lab and the most plausible explanation for this discrepancy has to do with the volatile nature of this compound and our sample collection method. So we actually tested four similar stainless steel gravity fed water filters at the same time using the same water sample from the five gallon bucket. The Pro 1 system was the first of the four units filled. And then the pre-filtration sample wasn't taken from the bucket until after all the other systems were filled. The most likely explanation is that there was bromodichloromethane in the influent water to begin with, but because it was at such low levels and due to its volatility, by the time we took our pre-filtration sample, the remaining BDCM in the bucket had already dissipated into the air. So if this theory holds true, it suggests that the actual concentrations were likely higher than the observed three parts per billion, with the Pro-1 filters possibly removing some percentage. But without conducting additional testing, we can't definitively determine what occurred or the extent to which the filters removed this VOC. 